Lionel Messi's journey to becoming the greatest footballer of all time is nothing short of extraordinary. From his early days as a young prodigy at Barcelona to his historic World Cup victory with Argentina, Messi's story is filled with moments of brilliance, hard work, and sheer passion for the game. His incredible achievements, including winning multiple Ballon d'Or awards and setting countless records, have made him a true icon in the world of football. But how did Messi reach such heights and what defines his prime years. Join us as we explore the rise of this football legend and uncover the secrets behind his unmatched success. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe to stay updated with more amazing stories from the world of sports. Messi's journey to glory. Lionel Messi's journey with Argentina took a huge turn in 2021 when he finally won his first major trophy with the national team, the Copa America. But Messi didn't stop there. In 2022, he led Argentina to a 3 endro victory over the European champions in the Finalissima and then went on to win the biggest prize of all, the FIFA World Cup. His incredible performances during this time earned him his eighth Ballon d'Or, making him the most decorated footballer in history. But if you think this is Messi at his absolute best with Argentina, you might want to think again. To truly understand Messi's peak, we need to look back at his earlier years. The Rise of a Legend Messi's prime years were nothing short of incredible. From 2009 to 2012, he achieved the remarkable feat of winning four consecutive Ballon d'Or awards, leaving fans and critics in awe. During these years, watching Messi play was like witnessing pure magic on the football field. Messi's journey to greatness began on November 16, 2003, when he made his debut for Barcelona at just 16 years old in a friendly match against Porto. Even then, the buzz around this young talent was strong, but no one could have imagined that he would one day become the greatest of all time. GOAT One of Messi's early teammates, Ronaldinho, who won the Ballon d'Or in 2005, saw something special in him. During his acceptance speech, Ronaldinho humbly said, This award says I'm the best player in the world, but I'm not even the best player at Barcelona. Ronaldinho knew Messi was destined for greatness, and he was right. Messi's rise rise to the top was just beginning. Stepping into the spotlight, when Ronaldinho left Barcelona in 2008, Messi stepped up as the team's main star. At just 19, wearing the number 19 jersey, Messi announced his arrival on the global stage with a hat trick against Real Madrid. This was the first of only two hat tricks that Iker Casillas conceded in his entire career, both of which came from Messi. The 2007-2008 season was a turning point for Messi. Despite Despite being just 19 years old, he was already among the top three Ballon d'Or finalists, standing alongside legends like Cristiano Ronaldo and Kaka. Messi's performances on the pitch spoke for themselves. As he solidified his role as Barcelona's starting right winger, his stats were incredible. Double-digit goals and assists, including six goals in nine Champions League matches. Although Cristiano Ronaldo won the Ballon d'Or that year, Messi took it personally and used it as motivation to push himself even further. Further. By the next season, Messi had transformed into an unstoppable force. The long-haired version of Messi became famous for his incredible dribbling and ability to toy with defenders. The Guardiola era, the 2008-2009 season, marked the beginning of a new era at Barcelona, with Pep Guardiola taking over as head coach. Guardiola recognized Messi's unique talent and decided to build the team around him. He moved Messi into the false nine role, allowing him to drop deep into midfield, confused use defenses, and create space for himself and his teammates. This tactical shift paid off in spectacular fashion. On May 2, 2009, in a memorable El Clasico against Real Madrid, Messi scored twice and provided an assist in a 6-2 victory at the Santiago Bernabeu. That season, Messi helped Barcelona achieve an unprecedented treble, winning La Liga, the Copa del Rey, and the UEFA Champions League. Messi's individual brilliance was rewarded with his first Ballon d'Or and FIFA World Player of the Year awards in 2009. But this was just the beginning of an era of dominance. Messi's unstoppable peak. The 2009-2010 season saw Messi reach new heights, scoring 47 goals in all competitions and winning his second consecutive La Liga title. He was also the top scorer in the Champions League, securing his second Ballon d'Or. Messi's performances were nothing short of spectacular, with his left foot becoming a 
lethal weapon that terrorized defenders. In the 2010-2011 season, Messi continued his dominance, leading Barcelona to another Champions League title and a third consecutive La Liga championship. He finished as the top scorer in both competitions and set a new record for the most goals scored in a single season for Barcelona, with 53 goals. But perhaps Messi's most legendary season was in 2011-2012, when he scored an astonishing 91 goals in all competitions, breaking Gerd Müller's record of 85 goals in a calendar year. Despite Barcelona's disappointment in the league and Champions League, Messi's individual achievements were unmatched. He scored in almost every game and became more likely to score multiple goals than not. His nine hat tricks, including a record five goals in a single Champions League match, were proof of his incredible talent. The ultimate rivalry. Throughout his career, Messi had a fierce rivalry with Cristiano Ronaldo, which pushed both players to reach new heights. From 2009 to 2012, Messi won an incredible four consecutive Ballon d'Or awards, but Ronaldo was always close behind, keeping the competition intense. In 2014, despite leading Argentina to the World Cup final and winning the Golden Ball as the tournament's best player, Messi finished second in the Ballon d'Or voting to Ronaldo. However, Messi consistently proved to be the greater player over time. In 2015, he led Barcelona to another historic treble, winning La Liga, the Copa del Rey, and the UEFA Champions League. At just 27 years old, Messi became the all-time top scorer in La Liga and won his fifth Ballon d'Or, further cementing his place in football history. His unmatched impact on the game and his remarkable performances during this period solidified his status as one of the greatest footballers of all time. Despite the rivalry with Ronaldo, Messi's consistency and brilliance on the field set him apart, making him a true legend in the sport. Messi's legacy. Messi's brilliance didn't stop in the early 2010s. Even as Barcelona faced challenges in later years, Messi continued to shine. In the 2018-2019 season, despite Barcelona's struggles in the Champions League and Copa del Rey, Messi's individual performance was phenomenal. He led La Liga in goals, assists, and chances created, and finished as the top scorer in the Champions League for the sixth time. Messi's influence on Barcelona was immense. Out of Barcelona's 90 La Liga goals that season, Messi either scored or assisted in more than half of them. His ability to carry the team on his shoulders was reminiscent of Diego Maradona's impact at Napoli in the 1980s. Messi's dominance on the field was evident in every match he played, and his consistency in delivering exceptional performances was unmatched. The final chapter. As Messi entered his 30s, he continued to break records and set new standards for greatness. In 2022, he led Argentina to World Cup glory, capping off an incredible career with the one trophy that had eluded him for so long. His eighth Ballon d'Or was a testament to his enduring brilliance, and his legacy as the greatest footballer of all time was firmly cemented. Messi's journey from a young prodigy at Barcelona to the Goit is a story of dedication, talent, and unmatched consistency. His prime years were filled with magical moments, incredible goals, and countless records. But even as he enters the twilight of his career, Messi continues to amaze fans around the world with his skill, vision, and passion for the game. Lionel Messi's career is a powerful reminder of what can be achieved with hard work, talent, and an unwavering love for the game. From his early days as a teenager at Barcelona to his unforgettable World Cup victory with Argentina, Messi has delivered performances that have left fans and critics alike in awe. But what makes Messi more than just a great player? What will his legacy mean for future generations of footballers? As we look back on his incredible journey, it's clear that Messi's story is not just about success. It's a celebration of football at its very best. Do you think anyone will ever match his greatness? What part of Messi's career inspires you the most? Let us know in the comments below. And if you enjoyed this deep dive into Messi's legendary career, don't forget to like, share, and subscribe for more amazing content.